Good morning, Massage Business Support Network. Leash here. I am, uh, well, actually, we, we had a bit of time on the weekend where we cleaned up our garage and I was looking through some stuff. I was looking for a particular folder. I opened up a packet of stuff and I found um, a brochure, a corporate massage brochure that we put together uh, maybe about three years ago. And I thought, oh, that is going to come out on my would love to know if you're on here, which would be super cool. Um, basically, what I want to show, I guess what I want to unpack is that we get a lot of questions around corporate massage. How do you do it? How do you find people? How do you go about it? And I just wanted to break down exactly what we did. We didn't have a massive success with it. It wasn't a huge part of what we did. However, we did crack the market in little old Ocean Grove. So about 13,000 people down here. We have one, um, you know, kind of, Cooperative type area, which is probably more like the um, like the business park. There's, the, you know, we had Reese Plumbing, uh, we had a uniform shop, and we had a cafe. That was about all we had. Hey, James, great to have you on here. So. Um, you know, there wasn't a lot of actual, hey Eileen, great to have you on here too. There wasn't actually a lot of corporate places to go looking for massage in Ocean Grove. But anyway, this is how we did it. And I just wanted to share it with you guys just to kind of break down exactly what we did. So I'm going to go zoop, turn around so you can see. Here we go. So we have, this is what we put together. It was basically, um, now let's see if I can help. It's actually shiny because, you know, I like shiny things. And you want to make it look as classy as possible. It had our business card in the top. I'm not saying that this is the absolute best thing to ever to do, but it's just something I found and I thought that it might be great to share with you guys. So you can see here, we opened it up. This was a, um, hey Glenn, great to have you on here. This was an article we had written for the um, Ocean Grove News, a local newspaper we were in and featured in quite regularly. That was an actual article that they wrote based on... Um, me and my story and how awesome massage is. So we kind of put that in there as evidence of success um, or social proof that we are we know what we're talking about. Um, this one here we had this is our brochure that we had at OG Massage. See how there's a lot of white space. Hey Rob, this is this would be really good for you. Um, see how there's a lot of white space. It's just very clear logo. Couple of things that we offer. Awesome photo. Really good photography where we're located and what we want them to do, which is basically check out um, our phone number and website. This we, we used to have in the clinic because it had all of our opening hours um, for what was available. Um, again, like us on Facebook, it's an old one, it's an old logo. Um, pregnancy bump packages, workplace massage, ta-da! Actually somebody doing workplace massage um, and what we would charge for that as well. And on the back here, we've got what we do the prices, etc. So that was literally our standalone fly that we would have in the clinic. Um, again, notice the white space. The biggest thing we see with flies is people try to put every single thing they've ever learned on their fly, and it's massive. Um, this is a what's called a DL size envelope, uh, a DL size fly, which means it's folded three times. It would fit in a DL size envelope. Cool. Enough about that. So we had a nice sheet here that James did up for me that basically had our logo at the top. It had what we were offering. We had three great options, which was the company pays in full, the company subsidizes the service, and the employee pays. So the investment was, it was $80 per hour per therapist. We did this down at Ivy Creations, which was a hairdressing salon for their team. We also did it at Balloons, which was a local cafe. Um, the, like I said, the investment was $80 per hour per therapist. The examples, the company pays in full, it's $80 per hour, employee pays nothing. The other, hey Shasta, great to have you on here. Company um, services subsidized by 50%. Basically, the, the uh, company pays $40 per hour. The employee pays 10 minutes, $6.60. 15 minutes is $10. Um, $20, $13, 30, 30 minutes, $20. The employee pays for the full thing. This is kind of a breakdown of costs. If we have a look over here, it's like if the company is paying for the service, we will invoice the company for the full amount one week before our visit takes place. If the employee is paying uh, for their services, we require a 50% deposit the day before. We can issue receipts to your staff and have them ready on the day of treatment to claim for their private health insurance. Um, hey, Jason, great to have you on here. Terms and conditions, one hour minimum charge out rate in Ocean Grove, Ballarat Peninsula, which is about probably about a 30K radius. 
two hour minimum charge out to Geelong. Massages must be booked in back to back by a booking sheet provided as any gaps in bookings must be charged. Eight hour minimum booking, um, uh, maximum booking available, minimum 24 hours required for cancellations to avoid a 50% cancellation fee. So that's kind of our payment options and terms and conditions. Now at Van Loon's Nursery where we are here, Van Loon's paid for it all, which was really great. Um, great. Hey Stacey, great to have you on here. At um, Ivy Creations, they paid for themselves. At um, another place we went to, which was a uniform shop, using and all of these were using these particular flyers, these particular folders that we put together. Um, the uh, Looking Smart paid their staff while their staff had a treatment and their staff actually paid for the session. Um, and we could receipt them and um, give them an invoice to claim for private health insurance. So that was that. This is just a really quick snapshot for somebody who doesn't have a lot of time. Remember, anyone, particularly small business owners, um, anybody in an organisation, they don't have a lot of time. They need to be able to see what you're offering very, very quickly. Here is a letter that explains a little bit more of what we do. So workplace massage. It's got a quote from um, a testimonial from one of our ladies that we did, uh, we worked with at Van Loons. Hi, as you probably know, healthy employees make a healthy business. A Medibank private study found that the healthiest Australian employees are almost three times more productive than their unhealthy colleagues. So here we're talking about benefits. On to watch, how do I get onto watching this live? You are in the Massage Business Support Network and you probably clicked on it, which is really cool. Trina, so great to have you here. Um, the same survey found that Australian employees' poor health behaviours have up to nine times the sickness absence of healthy individuals, 18 days compared to two per year. I actually have a copy of that study. It's a study commissioned by Medibank Private. Um, 74% and small business owners, you know, etc. in November 2005. I do actually have a copy of that in case anyone ever asked, which of course they never did. Our workplace massage gives employees and employers a unique opportunity to improve the health and well-being of their staff. As an employer who encourages employee health and well-being, you'll stand out as an employer of choice and it's likely you also have a positive impact on your organisation's productivity. Call us to today to see how Workplace Massage could benefit your organisation. Your first Workplace Massage visit is free if you book in by the end of April 2014, blah, blah, blah. Now, here's the deal. For anybody who's going leash, you never talk about offering free stuff. It's true. At that point, what was that? say 2014 so we're talking three years ago at that point I had particularly two new staff members who I didn't have a lot of work for well we did but we were we were building them so it was literally they just started and we were working on building them up as amazing therapists now the thing is if I was gonna pay them to stand there anyway I may as well be marketing their services through doing workplace massage so that's actually what we did. I sent them off to, yeah, Reese Plumbing was someone who we went and tried this with and they didn't take us on board, that's fine. Um, we tried this at Fags Minor 10, which is a big organization in Geelong. Um, we went in, again, didn't get regular clients. We did get regular clients through the, um, through the cafe, the hairdressing and the, um, the uniform shop that I was talking about. So we did quite a few different ones. Now it was only once a month that we went in, but what it meant was that one day a month, I was getting my staff to be paid for even after offering just one session. So it was a really great way of offering our services, filling up our time or my staff's time so that it, it was like we were actually doing marketing on a big scale. So that was why we did that particular special. That's how we packaged it up. And I thought that I wanted to share it with you guys because I knew that I know that lots of people ask about corporate massage. How do I get into it? How do I do it? And I thought this would be a great way to be able to share it with you guys and just give you literally an inside peek into what we did, what we know worked. Now, like I said, we're not talking like I didn't leave the clinic just to go and do corporate massage. I'm not saying we did it particularly well. I'm just literally showing you exactly what we did that did work 
the traction we got from it and giving you that inside peek. And I love to be able to do that for you guys because we're basically modeling the behavior that we want you to see. We know what, what gets results. That's why we're coaches. Well, that's why we run this group. We, we see things that work super, super well. We see things that don't work so well from running our own business, but also from the perspective of listening to hundreds and hundreds of therapists throughout the country, what's working, what's not, and working with a bunch of our own clients as well to know exactly what's working right now. What right now in our culture and in our history. Hey, Em, great to have you on here. Hey, Susan, I think this stuff was before your time. Um, you were the next lot of hire. Um, but yeah, basically we're just, we're just talking about corporate massage, how to get into it and the examples that we've got. So if you guys have any questions, usually I think it's Wednesday, we put, I don't ask any questions, by all means, Feel free to pop them in because if there's stuff that you want to learn about that you feel that you need more information on, let us know because we can either connect you to a training or we can, hey Debbie, oh, you're well, very welcome Susan, that's awesome. Send Susan some love guys. If this is really helpful for you, absolutely press the little love heart on your um, on your phone or on your device so that I can know that it's, it's connecting and resonating in, which is really cool. Um, if you've got any questions, post them below. Um, we absolutely love to get the feedback. We love getting, hey, thanks guys, I love that. Love getting feedback. We love getting, um, you know, questions. We love being able to answer them because that's what we're here for. We're here to help you guys turn that passion that you have to help people in the treatment room every single day into a rocking business. So have an absolutely outstanding Tuesday and I will see you guys tomorrow in the next video.